Hello and welcome to another video. Oh, hello bud. Doggy. So today we wanted to, okay she wanted to and I am volunteering to do it because <laughs> I want to do it too. We're gonna bake so what's the name of it? It's called Marble Cupcakes. It's like a mix of chocolate and vanilla cupcakes smushed together. So we're gonna see if we can master this. Um, so we're just about to set it up and get all the stuff ready. Um, and then we're gonna get started and see if we failed this thing or if we actually managed to do it. So let's do it. So we got our stuff. And we're trying to prepare and organize so it's easy. So right now we are just pouring it all into bowls get it nice and tight. This is cold, it's not warm, don't worry. We're fine. So yeah, that's what we're doing right now. That's what we're starting with. So the first step to making these cupcakes is to heat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and make sure you have a rack in the middle. Then you get to melt the butter so that you have melted butter. And we're doing it just so that it melts and then we're gonna let the rest of it melt, like with each other. It's hard to explain, but yeah. And for the butter, you'll need one and a half sticks. Correct. Sticks of butter. Yes. We have one and a half a cup of flour that goes into a bowl. There we go. And then we need one and a half tea spoon of table, no, of table, of baking powder to go in with the flour. Okay, the one and a half teaspoon of baking powder. Doop. There you go. And then one fourth a teaspoon of salt. And if you don't have one fourth, just do half of the half of a teaspoon. And then mix it. You can mix it with this. Yay! <laughs> After that, when you have stirred this, you poured in two thirds of a cup of sugar in here together with two eggs. I'm scared. Oh dear. Yep. We're, We're going to have some pieces. Uh, when you have it all together, you want to beat it up with an electric uh, beater mixer. mixer. <laughs> we have just changed locations because we realized that it's too loud and our dad was in a call. So we could. we're doing it outside now. Yeah, we're doing it outside. But it's okay because we have a screen so the bugs won't come in. Yeah. Screen and porch saves our lives. So this is sort of what it wants to look like. If you can get it more fluffy and foamy, try to. But this is what we're gonna go with. After you beat this up to a foamy white thing, you're gonna gradually pour the butter in while beating the eggs. Then you want to add two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Next part, you're going to mix it slowly while gradually pouring in the dry mix. of milk into the batter that, that we just mixed with the dry ingredients. Gradually pour. Otherwise it's gonna be a splash. And it will get all over the place.
There we are. So it should look something like this, I suppose, because uh, I'm no baker, so this is just what we're trying to do. But this is what you want to do, and then we're going to the next step. We have two tablespoons of cocoa powder, and then we're going to mix it into a third of the full batter, which is about a cup of the total batter. So we're going to mix that in with a spoon. Right, gradually no, or? No, just pour it in. Oh, it's stuck. There you go. This should make about 12 cupcakes, but we're gonna put on and fill it up and see however many we can make. So once you have all your cupcakes double lined, you don't have to do this if you don't have enough, but it keeps it from collapsing. So once you have them all double lined, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your vanilla and your chocolate, and what you're gonna do to make it marbled is you're gonna do one scoop of vanilla, then you're come, gonna come back on top of it with a scoop of chocolate, and then you're gonna do that to all of them. And then if you want, if it's not completely full, then you can go back and do it again, or how many ever you want, and, or you can do it based okay. on what you want. So we're just gonna mix it a little bit. So you take, you put some in the bottom, and I'll put some in the bottom, and then we'll put another mm -hmm. layer. Yeah, because that looks good. Because then we'll have some with the bottom with the chocolate and then some with the vanilla at the bottom. Do it like that so that they're not so stiff. Or like a little chunk. Kind of tap it so that it, they smear out a little bit. Now we have the bottom filled on each of them. So now we're gonna do this. The mark. We're gonna take some pieces of it and just put it over there. But make sure it's kind of marble effect. It's not straight, kind of. It, it's hard to explain. But. Oh, okay, <laughs> it's been involved. That's a baby. Fell. Baby Fell. grammar. Baby oh, grammar. Exactly. We should switch spot, right? Why? Because we're taking oh, yeah. each other's sides now. That's probably why I'm struggling. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Problem mm -hmm. solved. In the picture, Emery, they had more vanilla than chocolate. It's fine. So maybe vanilla. that's why there's less chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> that one is so tiny. I know. <laughs> Here, I can add tiny some. cupcake. Right. There you go. Tiny cupcake check. After you finish alternating colors, they should look a little bit like this. Fill them up halfway, um, and don't fill them too high because then they'll then they will bubble over. And then you need to tap it like this to try to flatten it out so that they get even. This one looks so Then you bake them in the oven for about 18 minutes, but we're gonna look at them at about 11 or 10 minutes to make sure they don't burn. So we have had them in now for about 19 minutes. They're getting a little bit golden brown. And we're gonna, we're making food here. We're making so. dinner <laughs> at the same <laughs> time. Very marble. That one is very marble. Very good. Let a grown up take it out. Cause this, you can burn yourself, so let's I think I'd burn it. myself very yes. easily. We got the one with the links to put in. <laughs> It's okay. Fine. Yeah, so this is kind of the effect. We just picked the wrong one. But yeah, that's what they look like. Hopefully they're good. Can I have one? I want the most vanilla. Mm. There's barely any chocolate in here. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. It's way better than the batter. The batter was not good at all. It was good. I have... It's like a sponge cake. Okay. 
That was all. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.